This is Carrick Station on Emergency Response Corps Priority Frequency. Master Satil, do you read us? Excellent. You've arrived just in time. The people of Kadamimu are being held hostage by a criminal despot. Governor Chornarov was under investigation for corruption. He was about to be arrested by Republic officials when he declared his planet's independence. What crimes was the governor being accused of? Extortion, blackmail, and fraud are the least of his offenses. His government abused its power thoroughly. Chonarov was able to seize power because of the Republic's missile arrays stored on his world, and the criminal army he's amassed. After Separatist forces were crushed on Ord Mantel, Governor Chornarov secretly offered their leaders and surviving troops asylum on Kadamimu. Darth Angrel had a secret listening post on Ord Mantel. I got to see the Civil War there up close. Then you know what Separatists are capable of. Unfortunately, they aren't our only concern. The missiles produced on Kadamimu are supposed to supply planetary defense batteries along the Selenon Spur, a major trade route. Those worlds now lie vulnerable. Governor Chornarov has commandeered enough Republic planetary-level weapons that a large-scale invasion is impossible. The missile arrays would destroy our capital ships in orbit. We have no way to remotely shut down those missiles? That's just bad design. There were deactivation codes, but the Governor's slicers disabled them. He's clearly been planning this for some time. I need you to restore the planet's defenses to Republic control. That will mean defeating Governor Chornarov's elite Separatist guards. The stealth-equipped assault shuttle is standing by. Your landing zone will be Kadamimu's capital industrial sector, close to the missile arrays. I'll get there as soon as possible. There is one last detail. Governor Chornarov is merely a corrupt politician. His private army's leader, General Ortal, is a mass murderer. Ortal sent thousands of innocent Ord Mantellians to their death. If you encounter that war criminal, bring him to justice. Hurry to Kadamimu before the remaining missile defenses come online and our window of opportunity closes. May the Force be with you. Fellow citizens, the coming days will be difficult. You will hear lies about civil unrest, about attacks on our soil. But our world is protected. Not just by our arsenal, but the Kadamian Guard patrols the streets to keep you safe. My people do not listen to the lies on the Holonet. There are no riots in the Mercantile District, and the missile batteries are perfectly safe. Citizens, some of you have questioned the makeup of the Kadamiman Guard. You ask, why have we recruited off-worlders? But I say, if a man like General Orto wants to fight for our planet, it would be selfish to deny him that privilege.
I fought in the war, you piece of trash! You think I'm afraid now? batteries are disengaged and the governor's shuttle just became vulnerable. Play the cleanup to us. Master Satil, this is Carrick Station reporting. What's the situation on Katamimu? Better than we hoped, thanks to you. Governor Chornarov was captured and his separatist allies are surrendering to our forces. Considering all the elite guards I had to fight, I'd expect the number of prisoners to be low. I'm sorry you were forced to commit such violence, but your efforts saved lives. Not only did you liberate Katamimu, you thwarted an Imperial invasion. We detected an enemy fleet dropping out of hyperspace at the system's edge. When the Imperials saw we commanded Katamimu's missile defenses, they retreated. Had they captured that world, dozens of systems would have been threatened. Maybe the Governor planned to join the Empire. Jonarov would never have turned over power, but it's possible his Separatist friends had other plans. It will be some time before Katamimu's government is restored. Until then, we'll maintain the peace. Enjoy your respite from the fighting. I'll be in touch. May the Force be with you.